Even now, after all these years, I still wait. Come on already. Stretch those red strings out to me and finish this. out of time. You need to kill me if there's going to be anything left worth saving. The virtual brain link cable will now be connected. This will hurt much more than it did in training. Be strong. Systems all green. Beginning SAS cable connection. I'm okay. We can do this. Seems like you're okay. This aptitude test will determine your platoon assignment. Do your best. Yes, sir! Kasane Randall. Identity confirmed. The other suppression force aptitude test will now begin. Exterminate all others. This test will decide my assignment. I hope I'm in the same platoon as Naomi. Thinking about it now won't do me any good. I have to focus. I should be able to complete the assignment as long as I'm calm. I can annihilate the other with my psychokinesis. Naomi even complimented me on how well I was suited for combat. It's done. I feel like I'm in good form, but I can't relax just yet. Next. It's done.
what I face. I just need to apply everything I've learned from my training. I can win. It got me. Okay, that ends your training. You're an official member of the OSF from tomorrow. Cadets now have 24 hours of free time until then. Make sure to get some rest before your duties tomorrow. Understood. Kasane! So, how was the test? Pretty easy as usual. How about you? I was able to handle an actual SAS connection thanks to your advice. You have a lot of potential. You should be more confident. I'm just glad you were so calm. You said that you had that dream again. The dream about red strings. You've been having that dream since you were little. Yes. Don't take your hands off the red strings. I wonder if it has something to do with your power. I don't think it does from what I saw of the OSF's analysis of my power. Worrying about things we don't understand won't change anything. I'm more worried about you. I hope they put us in the same unit. Yeah. Me too. I bet we'll find out soon, though. People tend to misunderstand you, so I'd be worried if I weren't around to look after you. Look who's talking. You're so clumsy, I have to stick around to protect you from yourself. Uh, that's so mean. <laughs> hey, aren't we going to Sumeragi Tomb after this? Oh, yeah. They're doing a collaboration with Baki right now. You get a keychain with every fortune. I can't wait. You really like Baki, don't you? Of course I do. He's so cute. Come on, let's go. Now that we can use brain talk, I feel like it's all we do. We don't have to worry about anyone listening in, and we can hear even if it's noisy. It's nice. You're right. I even talk to myself in brain talk sometimes. Don't laugh if you hear me, okay? There are a lot of people here. Well, the holidays just ended, and this is the Founding Father Yakumo Sumeragi's tomb. Wait, the collaboration event with Baki is at a gravesite? I think the country is trying to make Yakumo Sumeragi feel more like a familiar figure to us. Though people already pray to Yakumo like a god, so maybe they're familiar enough with him already. Yakumo, the hero who saved humanity. I think I saw him in one of my textbooks. He was wearing a mask. His face was injured during the Spring of Extinction. He's also the Chairman's ancestor. That reminds me, I heard someone from the Sumeragi family is in our class. So? Anyway, I found where we can draw our fortune. My fortune is a really good one. I'm starting to feel better about my life in the OSF. What about you? Mine is horrible. Okay, then give me your fortune. Hey! 
Here, you can have my good fortune. You didn't have to do that. It's just a scrap of paper. I'm the big sister here. I just want to protect you from bad luck. Thank you. No problem. You know, on days like this, you could almost forget there are vicious others out there. Yes, but we live in a world where these others roam freely outside the city walls. The instructors are expecting a lot from you. They're sure you'll reach a rank near Septentrion in no time at all. I don't care about rank. I just want to protect you. Honestly, what did I just say? I'm your big sister. I'm the one who's going to be protecting you. <laughs> of course. Hey, I mean it. What is it? Oh, it's nothing. I was just thinking that the boy on the right was kind of cute. Really? They both look like they were OSF members. You might get a chance to talk to him when we get in. You think so? That would be nice. Anyway, we got the Baki keychain we came for. Want to get a bite somewhere? Yes. Let's look for a cafe. An other alert? But today's other forecast said that there was no threat in this part of Suo. <sighs> They're landing here in the city. All units, double time! Go up the second wave through! for warning. They're deploying the Scarlet Guardians. <laughs> Septentrion Karin and Fubuki. The Major Generals Karin Travers and Fabuki Spring. Karin Regiment, Fabuki Regiment, Clan A, roll out. Civilians, head to the shelter. Huh? They're Septentrions, so we should let them handle this. Let's get to the shelter. Oh, right. Let's hurry. Power copies the powers of other psionics. That's why he can use so many different powers. The other is fighting back, but Major General Travers is unfazed. 
Major Captain Spring freezes the other without hesitation. These Septentrions are amazing. This isn't the time to be watching TV. We have to evacuate. Dangerous. We're not real OSF yet. We can't just leave that person to die. We're the only ones here with the powers to fight others. <sighs> if you want to save her, then let me do it. I'm going too. Fine. You take the right, I'll take the left. Got it. <sighs> Let's be careful. Don't push yourself too hard. Yeah, I know, but the... It's not safe here. Please, hurry to the shelter. Y yes ma'am Thank you! There's still another left. You ready? Yes. We have to make sure no one else gets hurt. Let's eradicate it. I wonder how many others there are. It's done. I don't know. Don't let your guard down. We'll take them out as we find them. Yeah, it's done. <laughs> Kasane! It's them! The guys I saw at Sumeragi Tomb! <gasps> seconds from now. Yeah, they're in trouble. Even I can tell. <laughs> you take care of the guy who got knocked down just now. I can handle that other alone. Got it. That's odd. You a civilian? Huh? It's her. Oh. You're OSF? Oh, no, I'm a cadet. I see. Either way, our goal is the same. What do you mean, goal? Are you an idiot? Huh? Shh. Something's coming. Huh? What's coming? Here we go. Huh? Okay. You're OSF too. You can use brain talk. Do you see what's happening? Let's talk after we take out the others. It got me. Not yet. Good work. That should take care of all the other readings around here. Yes. Kasane! I saved that boy! Nagi! You're okay! Yeah, Naomi saved me. Man, I must look like an idiot. I'm just glad you're not hurt. Thanks, sis. Oh, you two are sisters? Yeah, they're both OSF cadets like us. Let me introduce myself. I'm Nagi Carmen. This is Yuito Sumeragi. I'm Naomi. Naomi Randall. This is my younger sister. Kasane Randall. So it was you making all that trouble. Have a ready! 
eradicated the others. Huh? You saved Ryujin Ward in that amazing victory over the others. What? Well, what is this? A victory interview? It is. How do you feel? What? We should be able to talk here. Uh, what's going on? I'm Luca Travers. You're Septentrion 6th Class Luca Travers? It's embarrassing when you put it that way, but yes, that's correct. Are you all cadets? Please open your personal ports so I can confirm your identities. No objections? Thank you. So all four of you are OSF cadets. Cadets aren't allowed to fight others. I, I'm sorry. Isn't OSF responsible for allowing others to enter the local airspace and putting civilians in danger? Kasane! You shouldn't say something like that. Those are some harsh words. But you're right, Cadet Kasane Randall. I'm sure you all have something to say. But first, report to OSF headquarters. Keep away from the press. Got it? Understood. What's that? Oh, casualties from the battle. Two OSF troopers on guard duty were killed. I think it's censored, but it's best not to look too close. Huh? Why? Because others eat human brains. Yes. Looking at headless bodies can have negative lasting effects on your mental health. Oh, I just imagined it. They should teleport or report them out. It's too far to the morgue and powers aren't omnipotent. We have time, so let's talk a little. I'm sure you know, but one person can only use one type of power. But each kind of power has peculiarities and aptitude. Just as there are types of powers, each person has strengths and weaknesses. To use them in combat, we must rely on devices to lessen the stress on the brain. That's why things that can be accomplished without powers, or things with low priority, are done manually. Right, sorry. Now then, I'll be going. That'd be us if we didn't get the others first. I wouldn't let that happen. We're all 567th class, right? We'll stick together and become great fighters. Y yeah Don't worry. I'll protect you, sis. Let's go. Oh, goodbye, Yuito. Nagi. What's wrong? Why didn't we go with them to headquarters? Because we can't. Those two are nothing but trouble. We should stay away from them. But... Are you interested in that Yuito guy? Well, I did think he was cute when I saw him at Sumeragi Tomb. I see. Then I'll check him out. Stay away from him until then. Check him? He's a Sumeragi. Sumeragi? You know, the chairman of the council? Oh, so he's the chairman's son. That will make him easy to check out. Kasane... You don't pay enough attention to things, so let me do this. Let's go back to headquarters for now. Oh, wait. Your hair clip is crooked. Huh? Let me fix this for you. There. That's better. Th thanks No, thank you for putting it on. I know you don't really like things like this. I like anything you make for me. This shows that we're sisters, right? Yeah, it's just for the two of us. You better take good care of it.
Hey, there are those cadets. You must be cadets Naomi and Kasane Randall. That was an amazing fight against those others. Huh? Just ignore them. Let's go. You're still just cadets, weren't you afraid? Your father is the CEO of Randall Industries. Was it his idea for you to become cadets? <sighs> Talk about femme fatales right here. You. You're that Kasane Randall. So what if I am? Kasane, don't be so cross. Ah, uh, come on, Shiden. That's not how you make friends. Captain Seto? I, I wasn't... First things first, I need to take care of this right now. You're cadets Naomi and Kasane Randall, right? I'm Seto Narukami, 2nd Regiment, 8th Platoon. Septentrion 7th Class Captain Seto Narukami? Hmm? Oh, you've heard of me. Yeah, that's what they call me. The Chief Sumeragi has asked to see both of you. Hurry to his office immediately. Chief Sumeragi? Is he related to Yuito Sumeragi? He's Yuito's older brother. Oh, right. You fought alongside Yuito Sumeragi. I'm sure you'll quickly come to realize that the Chief is stricter than his little brother. He's probably going to chew you out for fighting without orders while cadets, but getting yelled at is part of your job. You'll be fine. I think you did a good job, though. Let's welcome our new members for this year. Kasane, Naomi, introduce yourselves. Kasane Randall, my power is psychokinesis. Pleased to meet you. Is that all? You seem shyer than I thought. All right, next. Yes, ma'am. I'm Naomi Randall. I'm Kasane's older sister, and my power is precognition. I can only see the immediate future, though. I'll do my best to help everyone out. I don't have much experience, but I'm glad to be here. That was a very good introduction, Naomi. The Randall sisters are our new members. Kasane graduated at the top of her class, and Naomi was fifth. They're both intelligent and very talented. That being said, they're just little ducklings who barely have their footing, so you all need to help them out. Now I'd like to welcome Shiden, who transferred from Kodama Platoon. Please introduce yourself. Shiden Ritter, 
My power is electrokinesis. I don't plan on being your friend. <laughs> Looks like you're still in your rebellious phase. What? Let's see. Gemma, you know Shiden, right? He's stubborn, so he didn't fit in with Kodama Platoon. But he's a real hard worker. Everyone be nice to him. T don't make fun of me! No one's making fun of you. I know you'll be nervous at first, but try to get along with everyone. We're a family here in Kyoka Platoon. Think of me as your mother. You can talk to me about anything. <sighs> oh, right. I guess I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Kyoka Eden, and my power is duplication. I'm leader of the 8th Company of the 1st Regiment, and commander of 1st Platoon. Everyone else, introduce yourselves. Gemma Garrison. My power is Scalerokinesis. Nice to meet you. I guess there are no volunteer soldiers here. Volunteer soldiers? People that joined the OSF because they wanted to, not because they were scouted. They're trash compared to scouts like us. Shiden, I won't have discrimination like that in my platoon. It's not discrimination. It's just a distinction. Take it back. Sorry. Um, I guess I'm last? I'm Haruka Frazier. My power is telepathy. Nice to meet all of you. Good. Now that everyone's been introduced, it's time for your on-the-job training. We'll be operating in teams of two. Kasane and Shiden, Gemma and Naomi, connect your SAS. I'll support everyone as commander. We'll rendezvous at Mizu Hagawa in one hour. Dismissed. Hey, Kasane. I'm team leader. Got that? I'm worried. What? You don't think I have what it takes? Huh? What are you yelling about? What? You... Sorry, but I'm going to get myself on a different team. Where does a new scout like you get the gall to make fun of me? Are you an idiot? What? <laughs> Kasane! We're all in the same platoon, so we have to get along. Sorry about that, Shiden. Why are you apologizing? I'm just worried about being separated from you. I'll go ahead and talk to the Major. Kasane, despite my looks, I'm the commander here. I'm much stronger than you, so don't worry. Also, from what I saw of her results, Naomi is a great fighter. You should believe in her. Understood, Major. Good. Remember to be nice to Shiden. Let's go, Naomi. Yes, ma'am. All right, let's connect our SAS. I'm the leader. What? You have a hearing problem? No. Good. Let's go, and don't fall behind. We're going to Mizuhagawa. You little... Kasane, hold up a second. You're Haruka, right? Yeah, nice to meet you. I have a message for you concerning bias. Seems like I missed you in the original communication. Sorry. Bias? It's the name of a brain assistance system that amplifies and helps maximize your power. It's being developed by the OSF. Every year they choose subjects to gather combat data on the system. You've been chosen as one of them. It's still in development, so it's unstable and they're not sure of the side effects. So they want me to be a guinea pig. What am I supposed to do? I'm glad you catch on quick. Well, it's in order, so you can't refuse anyways. Try starting it up. I think it finished installing along with other systems. Is this it? Nothing really changed. The system is working in your brain, using your power to make visions visible. Powers are just the ability to visualize in the end. They get stronger the more you focus on them. SAS connection should be smoother as well. Unfortunately, the pain never gets any better. I got the gist of it. I just need to keep it activated at all times. Also, this is just a rumor, but I thought you should know. 
Some say bias can cause people to lose their minds or become emotionally unstable. So take it easy. Tell me right away if you notice anything strange. Sure, I'll tell you if I do. Sorry to take your time. Don't be late for your mission. See ya. An experiment. I wonder if it'll work. Well, worrying about it won't change anything. The rendezvous was at Mizuhagawa. I'll head out when I'm ready.